hello <laughs> this is my first time i think ever i know it seems like most youtube channels start with a hey this is my first time ever doing something like this but it really is for me i don't tend to talk to a camera or record myself talking to anybody really it's kind of weird but i just wanted to give a little introduction to my new channel um, not too much content on here yet Mostly some drumming videos. I've been having fun with the, the Mapex Saturn. It's a Saturn III kit behind me. Um, I tend to tune my toms fairly low. I don't know if you can see it too much back there. Um, I have a mishmash of mics right now. Working toward getting a, a full set. Probably SE Audio. Although I've looked at Audix. I've looked at Sennheiser. There's just a million different options out there. Uh, but I'm looking at the... SE Electronics um, Arena V Pack, so we'll see how that goes. I hope to get that maybe in a couple of weeks. Right now, I have Digital Reference on the kit, their older version on the kit. I mean the kick, and then uh, the 10 inch, the 12 inch, and the 14 inch. And then I have a currently I have a Studio Project C1 on the on the 16 inch, which pulls in a thunderous uh, tone, which is great. I mean, it sounds wonderful, but I don't think that's going to be long-term. Um, it'll probably end up being a SE Electronics um, V-Beat or possibly some sort of kick mic on that one because I, I just it's really thunderous, that low end, if you listen to some of my recordings. Uh, I'll try to get... I don't always hit that tom, but I'll try to get it into more future recordings. Uh, the other mics, the two overheads are just terrible. They're just the cheap, newer NW700. They're they're just cheap. They're like twelve bucks a piece. They don't sound that great, but they're what I had. Um, currently, the hi hat mic, which is unplugged, but it is, <laughs> it's a Sennheiser uh, 67. I think it's K67. I I can't remember the, but it's. It's a shotgun mic for a camera or for recording voiceover, so uh, it looks ridiculous. I don't know if you can see it. I'm, doing, I'm backwards here. Right there. It's not plugged in right now because I stole the cable. Um, like I said, this is sort of a gorilla style. Everything is just kind of thrown together. My snare mic is a 57. Um, other than that, I think that's all the mics. Um... Yeah, I'm trying to think. I didn't really write out a script, honestly. I just kind of wanted to be myself because this channel is called The Imperfect Drummer, and I'm definitely imperfect. A lot of my recordings are not rehearsed a bunch. I don't practice a part over and over and over and over and over and, and, and then play it meticulously. I'm just having fun, so... I'll listen to something through a couple times and see if I can lay down a track to it. Uh, hopefully I'll get a little better. It's been a couple of years since I've played, and it's been many years since I've played continuously. Uh, mostly a worship drummer in church uh, with modern worship rock, you know, rock and pop style. And uh, yeah, it's been, it's been a few years, so my chops are a little rusty. Drums were my degree in college, but that was back in the early 90s, so um, my sticking patterns and things aren't quite what they used to be, and I certainly am not a, I'm not, I don't do double kicks, so you're not going to see any of those crazy um, fast stuff from me. I like to groove, so it's more of a just kind of laying into it. So As I progress, hopefully my timing will lock in a little more getting used to playing to a click again so, but it's been fun hopefully hopefully this gives you a little insight um, I'm actually a graphic designer and a web designer and I do some video but but I enjoy playing drums I crammed them into my office here and uh, hopefully I can uh, kick out some fun stuff anyway so welcome to my channel <laughs>